So let's talk about this movie a little bit. This sure. Is really, this, the storyline just seems like it's a couple that's totally in love, but the world just gets in the way. Can you tell me a little bit about the story? Sure. Uh, it, unlike other romantic comedies, this starts with the engagement uh, and then follows them over five years of a relationship changing and the power dynamic shifting and meeting new people and getting new jobs. And I guess the movie is really about how fluid relationships are. And when you choose a partner, you're choosing truly for better or for worse. And that power dynamic, did it play out in real life as well? Because I see a little bit of that during that interview right here. <laughs> the power dynamic in real life, did it play out on set? I don't know. I mean, I think... <laughs> did you I probably bullied... I, pr I am quite tough on Jason, but he's a very good sport. Yeah, she feels like my best friend. <laughs> we have a very easy time yeah. hanging out. We're like bros. I think we're both we're equally as powerful. Yeah, probably. We have different strengths. Different strengths. Over <laughs> and that's what I love about this comedy. It's like a romantic comedy, but just like you were saying, you guys are bros. It's we're like bros. a bro comedy, too, yeah. you know? Yeah. I think that's why it appeals to everyone, this film. I mean, it feels very, very universal. And, um, you know, guys might be dragged along unwillingly, even though I don't think they will because the trailer looks funny, and then be pleasantly surprised. And Because really, it's not a girly movie. It's a real movie. It's a movie that you can you know, you can basically completely relate to. And I think when people have watched it in screenings, you can hear the guys go, oh, oh, yeah. no. And then you can hear the girls go, oh, my God. And so people recognize their own lives in the movie. It's got romance. It's got humor. It's got sex. It's got, sex, it's got action. It's got bare asses. It's got, yeah, liter Not mine. literally, no, Not bears. Mine. Bear. <laughs> it's got bare asses. <laughs> it's a whole bare ass sequence. It's got food. It's got fun. <laughs> and your wardrobe is amazing. I mean, that sweater, you must have been so jealous you were not on set to see this sexy man in that becoming sweater. Oh, in the big sw hunting sweater. There's the hunting sweater and there's also the um, sweater tuxedo, <laughs> which is one of my favorite things of all time. Don't you do the running man in it? I don't do the running man, I do the Bigfoot walk. Oh, that's it. The classic it looked Bigfoot like walk. the running man. It goes like this. You've all seen the footage. Oh, that one. <laughs> Big, even Bigfoot knows the camera's there. I thought you were doing the running man and you were just... No, you've seen me dance. You would know if I was doing the running man. I have, actually. Or the Roger Rabbit. There's a lot of this stuff Or the Cabbage dance. Patch. You yeah, do a lot of that I do. stuff. You keep it close, yeah. Yeah, the, the legs pretty much over. stay where they are. And it's all this. And then there's a little of this. Yeah. So like all that. guys dancing, pretty much. Basically. Uh, well, we won't, we won't say that. No. Don't trivialize how great his dance is. Yeah, the, I'm live. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm agile like a gazelle. Well, I feel like your future is going to be really in Dancing with the Stars. Is that what's going to happen? With I you? love that show so much. I really don't want to end up on Dancing with the Stars. No, I don't think I'd want to do it, but I love, love watching it. You want to go together? Yeah, I would see it. Okay. Can you sort that out? I think I will work it out. Work it out. Sweet. <laughs> All right, thank you so much. Thank, thank you. you. Such a funny movie.